everybody welcome back to the channel so today what we're going to be doing i'm going to teach you how to tap strafe out of the gravity cannon so this is not the most perfect tap strafe coming out but it does help you get to a little bit more of a direction i want to just showcase those inputs that you saw there i'm not doing the biggest tap strafe out you can probably curve it and do a little bit more with it but i want to teach how to do it the biggest thing is that whenever you walk into the gravity cannon you're going to see it do that you want to be able to jump right before i kind of think of this like a delayed tap strafe if you will and I have the inputs on the upper left so you can see what I'm pressing there so when this happens what you want to do is jump and have yourself be mid-air this is going to be a very I know this is very basic but it does segue into utilizing the gravity cannon in various ways now when you do this whenever you jump right immediately afterwards you need to press the direction you want to go in this case I'm going to press D and I'm going to use the scroll wheel to immediately tap strafe to the right when you hear the audio noise that's whenever you want to shoot yourself as much to the corner as possible so when i go that way you'll see that i take a big curve immediately and this gets sharper you know the better you time it the worse you time it the less of a, of a curve that you're going to have i know this isn't the longest video but there's a lot that you can do with this and the reason why i have loba here specifically um, that can help i know you can double tap strafe out with a jump pad as well and it all matters whenever you press jump in your mid air what you're doing is you're essentially tricking the game into thinking what placement you are because you're mid air which can really really help you out this helps with horizon this can help whenever you're trying to hit a specific geometry to slide which you can cover in a guide as well but again if you find any of this helpful don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe i know this is very basic but it can really help you out in terms of what you're doing so an example let's say you jump and then tap strafe and then you want to even get any even further in terms of an angle and then throw your bracelet or whatever legend you're using it can really help you get to different angles just to be sure to not get caught out. The problem, the, the biggest thing with the, with the gravity cannons is that they're predictable and this helps you become a lot more unpredictable. So again, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys all in the next video.